Ooh, okay, this question is going to be a uh, slightly controversial, not really. <laughs> What's up everyone, it's time for your new Romsky video. Thanks for tuning in. Before I get into this video, I wanna quickly show you some stuff that's changed in the room. All right, so not a lot has changed. A quick update, we added a mirror. As if we, as if we're both involved. I, I, bought, my, I bought this mirror, not you guys. But yes, we got a mirror and it's got a nice aluminum frame. And as the winters got really, really cold, sick fireplace just to heat up the place real quick. And if you saw the original room tour of this room, you can watch TV. Bruh. It's gone. We moved the TV right over where it should be. Right there. Make sense? Makes sense. So yeah, that's what's changed. So yeah, clearly you can tell I, I love my room. I can't, I can't show you guys enough. I wish you guys could just like, actually never mind. Don't come live with me. That'd be creepy. I have a new game plan for this YouTube thing. Here's what's gonna happen. I am gonna have an actual structured plan because before all my videos were pretty impulsive. I would just shoot them, edit them, post. Shoot, edit, post. So I'm gonna shoot a bunch of videos. That way I'll be ahead of schedule. So I'll have two or three videos already ready to go as I'm working on other videos. That way it'll sort of keep me moving and we'll actually have content as we go through. Also, these Q&A videos that I do, I'm going to do less questions per video, so shorter videos, but more frequently posted. Make sense? Sure. So instead of these 12 minute videos, we're gonna have maybe three to five minute videos, okay? I think that's fair. And also easier on me, because then if I can shoot these videos really quickly and everything is structured and organized, editing them is so much easier. So yeah, I'm gonna start posting more often. So start sharing, get your friends to subscribe, get your parents, grandparents, daughters, granddaughters, ne nieces, nephews, in-laws, everyone. Get them on board. They need this. Let's get on with the questions. Question number one, do you get nervous around other skaters? Why? No, I, I don't see why I would get nervous around other skaters. We're all skaters. Not the complete truth. The only time I've ever been like, whoa, was at Skate America 20... 2017 Skate America. That's when I saw Yevgeny Plushenko for the first time in the flesh. And like, everyone's like acting normal around this dude. I'm just like... Do you know who that is? I don't even know why. I met all kinds of skaters and stars from all over the world. But for some reason, that one time in Skate America, I was like... <gasps> Who is this guy? Uh, question number two. How old were you when you started landing double jumps? And which did you land first? Double sow. As to when, I don't really remember. I'm gonna say like eight. Uh, question number three. After you started landing your double axle, how long did it take you to land triples? This is a quick trick question for me because I landed my triple sow before I landed my double axle. <laughs> but I landed in my triple axle before I landed my quad sow, so whatever. I mean, do whatever you want with that information. Hi. So, do you have some local figure skating memes? Not really. Not that I can think of, at least. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a normie. Hi, Roman. What's your top five favorite food? Ooh, oof. Uh, top five favorite food is a tough, tough question. Let's start with burgers, pizza, sushi, ramen. We're at four now. Five, you see, no. Five is the hardest one because then you're like thinking, which one can I live without? I'm not gonna choose the fifth one. I'll leave that up to your imagination. LOL! Thoughts on AirPods. My general opinion of Apple in general is not very positive, so I'm just not gonna put my two cents in. Ooh, okay, this question's gonna be uh, slightly controversial, not really. What are your thoughts on junior ladies quads and the current age limits in relation to US and Russian nationals? I'm gonna answer the first half of your question because honestly, the second half of your question, I have no knowledge of, to be honest. I don't follow along that much. So my general opinion about quads and stuff, you guys should know. If you don't know, uh, 
go to that video. In terms of ladies doing quads, especially junior ladies, I don't personally have a problem with it. Go for it. There's no way for ladies to land quads without good technique, honestly. If you have safe technique, it's safe. Safe technique equals safe. Whoa! I'm all for it. I know a lot of people are gonna say it's too dangerous and stuff, but I'm telling you, if your technique is good, which all of the girls that are landing quads, their technique is good because they wouldn't be landing it if it weren't good. I say go for it. And yeah, the second half of your question in terms of age limits of Russian and US nationals, I have no idea what that means. I don't know these age limits. I don't know anything, so sorry. All right, that's it. Those are all the questions I'm gonna answer for you guys. Next episode is gonna be a 2K special for getting 2,000 subs, which by the way, that video is probably done and almost ready to go by the time I post this. So I'm having a program, everything's ready to go. I'm hoping I can post maybe every two weeks. That'd be ideal. Every week is pushing it. Here's the problem is once I have files ready to be posted, I wanna post them right away. I have this temptation to just post and get the media out, but no, I need to stop myself, time it. Hopefully I can promise a video every two weeks. So if I have a schedule and if I have a backload of videos to post, Everything will be fine. All right. Like this video if you liked it. Dislike if you disliked it. Comment if you feel like adding something or asking more questions. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.